Congress and the Senate. Gentlemen, you were elected to represent the people. Now, I have a question to ask you gentlemen. Why is it that you didn't pass that law to protect whistleblowers? Why is it that because of that, Snowden had to go to Russia? And it is because you gentlemen didn't pass the law to protect whistleblowers. I myself am a whistleblower because there are too many things wrong in this country and unfortunately it seems that our Congress and Senate are up for sale to the highest bidders. That's why whistleblowers weren't protected. That's why we don't have jobs in this country rebuilding the infrastructure that corporations and the rich use freely but are not paying their fair share to keep it up. Our highways, bridges, and byways that they do not support because you gentlemen in Congress have given them tax breaks, welfare, where you can't even uh, support the people who don't have jobs because you gentlemen sent them overseas. This is an outrage, and I hope the American people start voting you gentlemen out, because we don't need our politicians to sell out this country to lobbyists who are willing to work for foreign governments, big corporations who get welfare, while the American people starve and lose jobs because you have voted for free trade agreements that send these jobs overseas in order to make the American people slaves to these companies here who take their tax dollars and give back nothing. When will we get a Congress and Senate that will start working for the American people? that will pass laws to guarantee our civil rights, to guarantee our freedom under the Constitution. When will we have a Congress and a Senate that will think about the American people, their jobs, rebuilding this country, and setting the course for a brighter future instead of a future that today I see only means low wages if you have a job and working for pay that doesn't support you living. Why should you gentlemen in Congress and the Senate get a better than living wage when you won't guarantee that for the rest of the American people? And why should you have a better health care system than what you voted for for the American people? We don't want you to tear that down. We want you to make it better. So I'm saying that you gentlemen in Congress and the Senate should give up your health plan and go on the affordable health plan. You should be on that. You shouldn't get any more than the American people get. Because you're supposed to represent us. You're supposed to be guaranteeing our freedoms. And it seems you're not. So when are you going to work for the American people?